What's up guys and welcome back to some more Pokemon Emerald the Randomizer Nuzlocke. We're in the last part, we lost Hornet and Lock. So two really good members we lost and if you could do me a favor to just make me feel better for all those losses, light up that like button and try to get it to uh, 100 likes. I don't know, I always like seeing triple digit likes, it's awesome to see. So today I have these guys on the party. Got Dragon Lady and Flora Sun. Flora Sun has Bullet Seed, Pound, Razor Leaf, and Ingrain. And Dragon Lady has Dragon Rage, Twister, Thunder Wave, and Wrap. And the other two are level 30, so basically everyone got a boost. And one thing I forgot to do is I think we can... Oh, this is a move tutor. Uh, so if we get a heart skill, we can go here, but... I, oh, this is the house I was talking about. Or I was thinking about. We have to go in here, and if we go all the way into the back, which we actually can't run in, even though this looks like a cave, I think... I think... Doesn't he give us dig? No, you you don't? Oh, I thought he gave us dig. Well, that's a shame. Do you give me dig? Oh, he gives me dig. But it's not really dig, it's a random move. So, let's see what that is. Weather ball. Hmm. And actually, I was looking at moves. And Oh, by the way, uh, I picked up TM41, which I don't even know what it is. I just found it on, like, that uh, dr uh, snowy... No, not snowy. Uh, ashy root. Um, TM for return, so maybe if someone really needs that, I'll give return. But Dragon Lady can learn Frenzy Plant, and I mean, it's a better move than Wrap, so. Let's just give Dragon Lady Frenzy Plant more coverage for me, and uh, we must go down to Meteor Falls now, because that's the next place to go, obviously enough. So let's try to avoid all these people. I did train on all these people, as I did say before. It took a little while to get, like, two level 15 Pokemon up to level 27. I was originally going to go everyone to 30, but 27 was good enough. I was done. And I was tired, so... That was part of the reason that there was an upload yesterday. And another part was I've just been very, very, very busy. And, you know, stuff like that. So, oh man, it's Team Magma with their meteorite. They can go to Mount Chimney. Hey, what are we doing? I don't even know what I'm doing here. Hold it right there. Uh-oh, there comes Team Aqua, or whatever they were called before. I think the Captains. Captain, or something. I don't think we battled Team Magma yet. But I think once we go to the Mount Chimney, that's when we do start to battle them. So, sounds pretty cool to me. So, let's just get through this because, uh, I don't even know. Don't care too much. All I care about is beating people's butts and not talking about people's butts. So we gotta defeat Team Magma in Mount Chimney. As I said before, Tiny Mushroom. And is there a way I can get back up? Because I want to go down. Ooh, there was also Blissies in here. Which was a really good Pokemon to grind on. So that's where I did most of my grinding in here. And you always want to defeat a Blissey whenever you can. Because Blissies give out a butt ton of experience. So 30, 327 for all. And uh, some Giraffe Rigs are in here. So I'd say getting a... Sunflora was the worst Pokemon that we could have gotten here, and I actually didn't see many grinding. I saw some chokes, I saw some blissies. I saw some giraffe rigs. And uh, I could say very confidently that Sunflora was the worst thing that we could have gotten, so. Congratu congratulations, Sunflora, for being so bad that. Oh! What is with Noel? I don't understand. But enough of this Noel stuff. No more funny business. And I don't want to hop down there because then we'll have to go all the way back and all the way around. So I'd just rather battle these people. Chloe and Noel. What? Is this game seriously, like, doing this to me? Actually, let's go for Frenzy Plant on you and Bullet Seed on you. Just to get all that damage off on the Pokemon. It's very scary. Ooh, a Swampert. Good thing we have Flora Sun. And a Jirachi. Not a good thing we have Florissun because Florissun sucks. So take out that Swamper. Very good, very good indeed. Florissun, you are a beast. Go for the Dragon Range and go for the Razor Leaf. Hopefully that can kill. Went to sleep. Okay. Dragon Rage, Razor Leaf, and that should be GG to Jirachi. Okay. Good job, Jirachi. Thank you. And I don't, I don't understand Noel. Like, what is with this game and like naming everyone the same? Alright, if your name's Noel, I... Okay, thank you. I think we saw Leo before, but... We don't care about originality. All we care about is Noel not being in the game. 
So good thing we have Shed Skin because we were able to get rid of that sleepiness. And Double Click will do nothing to us. Dragon Lady. Hopefully we can keep Dragon Lady all the way to be up to a Dragon Knight. That would be awesome. Bug Catcher Leo. Okay, but you're not a Bug Catcher. So I guess I'll just speed right up and back to uh, Mount Chimney. Because we have to go all the way back there. We just had to come down here just to go back up and talk to these people. So, you know, a little bit of a uh, waste of time. But I think in Pokemon Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, they're going to have like... Some sort of double battle with you and your rival in that cave. Because there was a screenshot of like you and your rival both like walking into the... I'm pretty sure it was Meteor Falls. It was like a purple background with like rocks in it. But I'm pretty sure that was Meteor Falls. If it was not and you guys saw that screenshot, you can correct me. But uh, let's see if we... I picked up the soot sack, by the way. So let's see if we can get anything. Oh, man. We need to get more steps. We need to keep huffing and puffing. You know, this is probably really bad for our lungs, so... That guy just wants us dead, basically. Dragonair! What's up, Dragon Man? I think that was a man. I don't, I don't even look at the gender, but it's nothing as good as my Dragon Lady. So, of course, one more little step we had to take, and we weren't there. So, let's hop down, keep on speeding up, because there's no reason to... Uh, wait... For... I don't know time to wait for slow walking, and I probably should set up more repels, but this is just getting annoying, and there we go. We don't really have to worry about Pokemon anymore. This place is clear, and we can go up in here, and, uh, there's a, I don't know if it's like a glitch or like an Easter egg, but sometimes you see like a little man, just like a hiker man, like, down in the bottom, so, it's very rare. It's very rare for that to happen. It did not happen for us, but you just see him like climbing up the mountain. It's a pretty cool thing that you can see, and look at these Poochianas fighting. Uh, there's also a screenshot of the battle with Maxi up in here. So I think they're going to have like the same storyline as Pokemon Emerald where Team Magma is taking over Mount Chimney. Maybe it's still going to be different for each game. I don't know how they're going to do it. It's going to be strange how they like mix. Since we know what we know about Emerald and the storyline, it's going to be interesting how they like mix that into the Ruby Sapphire remakes. Like, will they go by what Ruby Sapphire said or will they go by what Emerald said? I don't know, it's going to be pretty interesting. They may, they may just go with Emerald because Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver basically did what Crystal did with like the, I don't know, the legendary, the, the legendary dogs. Um, but there were some differences like, the, of course, the Ho oh, and Lugia. But that'll obviously be different for Kyogre and Groudon and their primal forms, which look super awesome. So take out that Schnubbable. And what else you got? Manetric, so... If we were actually in Pokemon X and Y, or even Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, Dragon Lady would probably be dead. We faced a Clefairy and a Snubble. So, poor Dragon Lady would have been dead if we were in the future, but since we're not, we are in the past and we can take out Blastoises with Frenzy Plant. So, I, oh, wait, this is actually a Tabitha, I believe. So, Tabitha, you tried your hardest, but you could not succeed. And this, is, of course, is Maxi. And he's uh, going to put his meteorite into his little thing, so... This is always a challenging battle as a, uh... As a little youngster. I always had trouble with this battle. Maxi was pretty hard. I remember coming back to the top of Mount Chimney plenty of times and trying to defeat Maxi. Always a challenge. So, Maxi, let's do this. Lady Wayne! That is very intimidating. I would not want to mess with you, Lady Wayne. Not at all, as long as you're not Lil Wayne, if you know what I'm saying. I, I could probably not want to mess with Lil Wayne, I don't know. Would you? Uh, let's go into Snowball here, we could speed this up a little bit. Sidewave does not do too much, and I'm not sure if we learned Crunch on screen or off screen, but we have Crunch now, and it is super powerful, and super cool, and super effective. Mm -hmm. So take that side beam or side wave, whatever that was, and dish out the crunches. Dish him out to the Grumpig. Make him suffer in pain. Yeah. So Snowball gets a little bit of experience. That's fine with me. Metatite, you can probably also die to a nice crunch. Metatite's pretty weak. Medicham, on the other hand, would be pretty dangerous, but... This is not a Medicham, and it's not even a Mega Medicham, so Lady Wayne will die to 
some crunches if he decides to actually die and not detect and keep on healing like a little baby. So there we go. Snowball defeated Metatite. And uh, let's see what he's got up last. Blossom. Okay. I think this could be a nice snowball sweep. If you know what I'm saying. I'd much rather have a Blossom as his main Pokemon than a Camerupt or even a Mega Camerupt with its shaggy little skin. Um, should we heal up or should we go for it? Let's go for it. Let's risk it. No need to be afraid of Blossoms. So let's do it since we did hit and did not get paralyzed. So good job, Snowball. Good job, Floor Sun. I think that's basically all that was in this battle. So... Our team's looking super powerful, even though we have a subfloor on the team. That's basically how this goes. So, Maxi, enough is enough. Stop with your stupid stuff. And, uh, what's up, Archie? Now, I can't tell if Team Aqua or Team Magma are going to be the villains. Like, because they both look like villains, and there's no way that since they look so evil that they're going to be one good team and one bad team. So... They're probably both going to be bad in the next games. Chloe, I don't care about you. Um, and nothing up here. Now we can go down and go through the Jagged Pass. Yes, the Jagged Pass. Maybe we should get some lava cookies before, so we have a lot of money. Here is the Jagged Pass. Of course, I remember the name of it because I don't know. That's a good reason. Uh, remember this guy. He's very important. Oh, we have to... Oh, we get to battle him. Okay. And your name's Mark... You have a Nuzleaf, and we can kill you, and we can take a Rock Slide, okay. Let's not remember about Nuzleaf's hitting, uh, Nuzlocke's, Nuzleaf's hitting Nature Power Rock Slide, okay. Uh, okay, whatever. I was just looking at something now I shouldn't be looking at, and, uh, Ingrid, hmm. I don't want to get rid of Razor Leaf, but I also don't want to get rid of Bullet Seed, because if Bullet Seed hits more than two times, it'll do more than Razor Leaf, but if it doesn't, it'll do less. This also has a high critical hit ratio, but I'll just get rid of it, just for the fun of it. And, uh, Vaporeon is up. Oh, no, we have, we have a Frenzy Plant. Can't forget about that, but it does not kill. Vaporeon is a beast, so let's do a little twist and defeat Mr. Mark over here, and I think I actually ruined my chances of... Oh, no, I didn't of getting a Pokemon. So let's talk to this lady with the little camper sailor hat. Uh, ooh, let's switch out. That is not too good. Go to the old Gramps. Gramps can go for a rock gun. <laughs> yeah, rock gun. It's a real thing. You just throw a rock looking gun at a person and they die. So of course, this guy has like every counter to all of my Pokemon. I bring out a rock water type, he brings out a grass type. What the heck's wrong with you, man? Why are you so low leveled? We're not really over leveled. Are we? I don't know. But here's Whiskash, so we can go into Floor Sun now and take out the Whiskash. So, little Whisker. Oh, yeah, we did have Whiskers on the team as well. That's sad. So, you're defeated, and time to catch a Pokemon in the Jagged Pass. Let's see what it is, and I don't know why this place is not covered in ash, but the rest are in... Ooh. I don't know what to do with my eyes. But an Absol, that is... It's not too bad. That is not too bad at all. Oh, well, I gotta go for Sunny Day. I don't even know. Uh, let's go for the Pound. And, oh, wow. That did a decent chunk of damage, didn't it? Uh, razor Wind, he's whirling up a big Razor Wind, and we should go for another Pound. No critical hits. Please and thank you. Go for that. Oh. Okay. Come on, Great Ball. I don't want to waste my Master Ball. I'm probably going to use my Master Ball if we ever catch a Legend. Let's try to get a Luxury Ball. Wow. Um, I guess that worked. So we have to call Absol a luxurious name. Like... Um, I don't know what... Uh, luxurious name is or what that even means so we have to call you we'll call you jewels yep because that makes total sense because jewels are very very good and uh 
Luxurious. That's the word I was looking for, so, okay, we didn't. Let's see what else we could have found in the Jagged Pass. A Lapras, that would have been very, very awesome. So there we go, escape, please. And, oh, I didn't really want to battle you, man. I'm sorry, but engineer Forrest. Run, Forrest, run. I probably made that joke every single time I've seen someone named Forrest, because Forrest Gump, he, he's a legend. Um, go for that, Rock Tomb. Take out that Golbat. Yes, very nice, and thank you, Azuril. I feel bad for you, Azuril. I'm sorry, you evolve into pretty cool Pokemon, but as an Azuril, you're not too good. So here we go, Route 112. Uh, I'll battle you later. Never, probably. Or maybe if we accidentally run into you on our way out. That's the only time I'll probably battle you. So there we go. Um, no one died, did they? No. I don't probably keep Jules on the team. Uh, we do have some dark type moves on you, but you're not really a dark type, so. Um, doesn't he give me the egg? Who gives me the egg? Oh, you give me the egg. Okay. I'll take the egg on the team because it's a random Pokemon. It's not a why not, so. That's pretty darn good. Um, into the hot springs and get the Aguave Berry. That's usually like an ice heal. I don't know what an ice heal is doing in like a bathtub. So let's get out, or hot tub, let's get out of that hot tub full of old ladies. And uh, prepare for trouble because we are about to take on... Oh, my bag's full already? Okay. So let's let's clear some space. You know, actually, let's give the... Uh, I want to give the experience share to Absol. So let's... We place that with the Miracle Seed and give the experience share to Jules. Okay. That works out pretty well. Four Sun's getting some decent levels on him. And, uh, yeah. Dragon Lady, you know, you're still hanging in there. Uh, so maybe I'll sell some items maybe after next episode because after this, I am going to be recording another episode. And maybe another episode after that. I don't know. I have to do some recording, so it should be fun. And then, oh, if you didn't know, this is the end of the episode. This is where we get to say our goodbyes and be very sad, but you only have to wait till the next day or if I decide to record another video and another video will be posted. I'm sorry about not doing my two uploads, but as I said previously in this episode, I'm getting pretty busy. It's getting a little hectic in my life. Not really life, just my time. My life's fine. Um... Whatever, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. That's probably really weird, because I like don't look at the camera a lot. I like look at the screen, and I look at myself, which is probably very egotistical. But stop wasting time, and start ending this episode. So see ya later.